what's up everybody and welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be making a diy t-shirt from the dollar store so you get your plastic wrap from the dollar store which is literally a dollar you get your parchment paper non-stick oven safe from the dollar store print out whatever template you want to have on your shirt i printed that out and of course the dollar t-shirt from the dollar shore three dollar project you guys cannot beat this if you have children or if you just want to make a t-shirt not pay somebody twenty dollars this is the way to do it so i positioned where i want the picture on the t-shirt and then i just wanted to make sure i cut around it so here you see me just cutting around it i kind of want it just a little bit more curvy Now again, you could just print out whatever image you want and leave it as a square, but because I plan on wearing this shirt a lot, I will definitely cut it to my liking. And I can even add some images later on if I wanted to as well. Alright, so now I am going to place it where I want it. I'm going to take the plastic wrap. And I am going to wrap it around the image that I have on the t-shirt. Now, I took a smaller piece, so I eventually ended up taking two pieces. So all you do is you take the picture and you wrap it around so that it covers the entire picture so you don't have to take a lot. Towards the end, you'll see that I have excess plastic wrap that I should have cut off. But again, it's okay. Um, I'm just grabbing a, another piece of plastic wrap right there. And then I'm just going to wrap it around the picture again. So you print out the picture and you put plastic wrap around it. And as you guys can see, I do have extra. So if you guys end up doing the same thing that I did, just make sure you cut the excess plastic wrap off. You see that right in the corner right there. So then you're gonna position it again. You are going to take your parchment paper And you are just going to place it on top of that picture with your plastic wrap. So as you put the iron on, the iron is basically melting the plastic wrap on top of the t-shirt. So this iron that I have is very, very weak. So I had to go over it a couple of times and you'll see that in the video but if you have a really good one you'll probably be able to go over it once or twice and it will melt very nicely onto the shirt so you just leave that iron on there and let that plastic melt into the shirt melting Again, like I said, my iron is not the best. So if you want to kind of fast forward a few seconds, go ahead and do that. 
Okay, I'm done. Now, now that it's cooled off just a little bit, you just push it down, make sure it's not too hot. Give it about three to five minutes, I would say. I definitely did. And now that it is done, we are going to slowly peel it off. Again, like I said before, you will see the excess plastic on there. Um, I could have cut it off, but um, I plan on adding to the shirt and that will just cover up the access. So if you just have one image, make sure you cut the access off so that is a, it is a crispy, clean look on the t-shirt. Look at that. Beautiful. So cute. My own creation and it only costs $3. You guys see the access wrap right over there? Yeah, make sure you cut that off. And down there. But if you do want to wash this, just make sure you pull it inside out. And it is good to go. Thanks for watching. Peace.